clean. Mm. This place was hidden using a special Adepti art. But now that I have removed it, we can inspect the area more closely. Great. Wow, that's amazing! Yep, let's take another look around! Hey, look! Is that a new Celia over there? Yep. Eh. Waterfalls. The Sealy got to here and then disappeared. Should we go over and take a look? Oh, it's just here. Cryo Geo. Ryo. This will be interesting. Uh. Don't disappoint me. I'm gonna take a range character just in case there's some good buffing. I wanna keep Lisa for damage, honestly. This is the abode of that Adeptus. Yep. With any luck, the sunset familiarite we're looking for should be in here. Really? Let Paimon see! Huh? Isn't that the Sealy from before? Yep. Look, it's gone and snuck beneath the clouds! And now that Paimon takes a closer look, the rocks and trees here don't seem complete. Oh, could there be something below the clouds? These are not real clouds. They are the product of an Adepti art used for spatial partitioning. Mm. If we want to go down, we must first destroy the mechanism that is maintaining the Adepti art. All right, then let's do it. I sense the presence of mm. monsters in this place. I don't know where they are hiding, so we'd better be careful. Okay. Hmm. Here. Yeah, yeah. Unleash. Don't waste my time. One down. Up here. Listen, lock now. Obey, manifest. It appears that we've been taken for intruders. This time, why not allow me to take care of this? Up here.
I'm gonna go and grab that chest. Bit of loot. Not much, but still enough. like we need to go further down but before that let's destroy the guard mechanisms on this level first come a little closer let it rain yeah it was dumb Break it. Falling down again. <coughs> nope. Run guard. Thank you. 
down. Come on. This thing. Just. Don't be such a brute. Don't waste my time. Submit. It's nothing. You're in for a little shock. Come a little closer. Rude. Unleash. Manifest. Come on. heal yes uh, that's for, for revival Strength, defense, cool it. Come a little closer. <laughs> Try not to enjoy this too much. Unleash! Do your master's bidding! Obey! No one escapes my sights! Manifest! This moment will be frozen in time. Mom.
boss battle? No. Just a giant rock. Look over there! Could that be the sunset vermilionite? Maybe. <laughs> Come on, little silly. Loot. Is this it? Is this the sunset vermilionite? Apparently. To activate it. Paw straight doesn't float until it's activated. It may look different from most ordinary stones, but it weighs around the same amount. Mm. Only after being activated does Paw straight reveal its true nature, breaking free from the shackles of the mortal realm and ascending up into the heavens. Mm. Wow, Shenha, you seem to know everything about this. Only mm. because my master is fond of chatting about these things. The moment she has some time to spare, she'll come straight for me and start telling story after story. <laughs> I don't care for her stories most of the time. I certainly didn't expect them to ever come in handy like this. Mm -hmm. Hold on a sec! Paimon just realized something. That is? If we <laughs> activate it here, there's no way we'll be able to get it back to the site, right? Heck, we'll be dragged up into the sky too! <laughs> I can handle the weight quite easily. Hmm? Are you sure? Uh, be careful. Please don't worry. Mm. I'm well aware that a plostrite sample this large must be highly valuable. I will be gentle with it and make sure it does not get damaged. Hmm. My safety. Yep. That's right! I'm unsure you can handle it and everything. But if something this heavy lands on you, you're gonna get yourself hurt, no matter who you are. Mm. You gotta be extra careful when lifting heavy objects. It's just common sense. <laughs> hmm. Mm. Is it now? Hmm. Well then, thank you. I'll go on mm. ahead with the plostrite. Let's meet at the building site later. Okay. Oh my god, I can't believe my eyes. How can she lift that massive rock all by herself? She's got to be one of those Adepti, surely. Hmm. Oh, mighty Adeptus, please give me your blessing so that in the coming year I may reap a more bountiful salary. Hmm. This is top tier in size and quality, and the condition it's in is quite simply immaculate. Congratulations. This item is approved for submission. Mm. I'm going to award you full marks for the Sunset Vermilionite item. May I take your name? My name isn't important. I'm not even here to compete. Mm. I was just delivering this for some other people. They should be here any minute now. Shenha! And Ningguang's little helper! <laughs> ah, so you're the ones behind this. No wonder. The rarest talent turns in the rarest plostrite specimen. But I have to correct you on one point. It's not helper, it's secretary. Okay. <laughs> okay then, Miss Secretary, what do you think of the rock we found? Pretty amazing, right? In truth, it is mm. the finest piece of plostrite we have received so far. 
But if everything goes according to plan, we will use this piece in the foundation of the Jade Chamber, mm. which will enable us to proceed to the next stage of construction. Mm. As a side note, Lady Ningguang has rented some dwellings in the nearby area to serve as accommodations for the contestants. If you need a place to rest, you are welcome to stay there. Mm. Now, please excuse me. As you can see, there is still a lot of work to do on the building site. Okay. Shenhua, Shenhua. Just now on the way over, pretty much everyone was singing your praises. Oh, mm. really? Yep. What kind of reaction is that? So strange. Aren't you happy about it? <laughs> Whenever Paimon gets praised, Paimon can't help but hold her head up high and break into a big smug smile. True. I've had similar mm. compliments before. But they call me an adeptus, treat me with great deference and respect, as if I'm set apart from the common mm. folk. Yeah, cause that's how adept I are. At least the ones we've met are pretty unique and reclusive too. Way different than normal people. Mm. But uh, I am not... Uh... Shenha? Mm. I'm fine. I've been exerting myself quite a lot ever since we set foot in that abode. Uh, I'm just a little fatigued. Mm. Um, well, Byron said that there are some makeshift hotels we can use, right? Let's go check in and take a rest. Great. No need. I simply need to find myself a secluded place in the wilderness to sit and meditate in silence. You can't no. do that. Go eat something tasty, and when you're tired, you go lie down in a nice, comfy bed. All right? Seriously, don't punish yourself like this. Mm. Okay, if you insist. Great! Now we're talking. Let's head to our hotel. Okay. <laughs>